to be with my Lord. I don't know about you. I don't know about you. But I know about me. Betty won't be here. I'll be up there with my Lord rejoicing to see my mother, to see my grandmother, my aunts and uncles, and some of my grandbabies. I'm going up there to be with my Lord. How many can say that? Let's give God a hand clap on today. He's worthy. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank the Lord. Songs and we thank God for the everything so far has been great. Everything has been great. But we are looking forward from our pastor for the word because we want to know what thus said the Lord. And I know that God has given him a special word for us on today. But before he comes, our praise dances will come and perform um, and after they perform let's stand in honor of the anointing on Pastor Wooten's life and let's cheer him on yes. amen. amen it's not just for him but it's for us and we want to hear what thus said the Lord Is, are the praise dancers ready Amen. I just thank God for all of our visitors on today. I want to recognize our visitors. We're so grateful that you chose this church to come, to stop by, and to fellowship with us. Amen. We appreciate you. I know there's a lot of churches that you pass by, but we feel so blessed and so honored that you came here. Did any of you want to say anything? Our visitors, you want to say anything? You want to say anything? So you are welcome, welcome, welcome. Amen. Amen. And we thank God for each of you. Now I know that uh, we have a lot to look forward to in the month of March. And as we present our bodies as a living sacrifice unto God because that's what he says yes. to present our bodies as a living sacrifice because that is our reasonable service I want to sacrifice by coming to Sunday school getting my grandkids here praise God y'all keep us in prayer yes. and if you can please come yes. we don't want to miss out time is winding up yes. Yes. we need to know more about what God, what our assignment is, as Sister Natasha so gracefully and eloquently spoke. Yes. What is your assignment? God has a purpose for each of you, and we have to fulfill that purpose before we leave here. We need so much in the churches today. We don't have the anointing, I don't feel, like years ago, but it's here. All we have to do is press. Press. Yes. We can't sit down on God. Yes. There's a saying, push. Pray until something happens. Yes. So we want something to happen here in Daniel Church of God. Amen? Yes. Let's give God a hand. Praise God. Praise God. Thank you all so much. This was my dream to have this service today, the last Sunday in February. Uh, commemorating the whole month and just coming together and letting our young people participate. As Natasha said, it's time for us to pass the baton. Yeah. And when I asked Ari to read the scripture, she's like, I don't want to do it. <laughs> but we have to teach them and train them in the way that they should go so that when they're old, they won't depart from it. They have to come and take the place of us that are going to be leaving here. Amen. Amen. And I'm so happy to see Mother Rogers in our midst and Ooh. Mother Wooten in our midst. You know, a lot of churches still have not opened, but we have been blessed to be able to come in unity, Amen. come together, and give God praise. 
We have to learn to encourage one another. They, the Bible says when you are weak, the strong has to 